Now, Catholic bishops are raising alarm over the growing cases of corruption allegations in the country. The bishops want to graft cases investigated and concluded rapidly. Led by the chairman of the Bishops' Conference, Philip Pagnolo, the clerics also warned politicians against early campaigns. They have also pronounced a countrywide ban on politicians campaigning in churches. It is now clear that if strong action is not taken, there is real concern for the government, for the government might not be able to control the violence that may erupt during election time. Dear Kenyans, elections come and go. We must never allow ourselves to be used, to be used for political expedients every election period, only to be left wounded, maimed, hopeless, and divided more than ever before. And hate speech, we wish to caution again and again our politicians to avoid inflammatory language and the tendency to set one community against another. There are those politicians who known for uttering what amounts to hate speech. As election period is um, around the corner, let them promote peace and harmony among our communities. We call upon the clergy not to use the church or the pulpit to promote any political candidate. It is important to note that Church law forbids priests from engaging in politics or presenting themselves for elections to political positions. The nature of their calling makes them signs of unity to the people living in their jurisdiction. We have further stated in our earlier statements that as Catholic bishops, we are not going to allow our churches and church functions to be used as campaign platforms and forum of hate speech. As much as politicians and those aspiring to elective positions are free to worship and pray where they want, they should not use such opportunities to make their campaign statements. Consequently, politicians should not be allowed to address the congregations in our houses of worship.